Hello everyone, it's Charlton. It's uh, still late and uh, so I'm going to be a little quiet, but this is breaking right now. Like in the last hour, they have caught the, uh, the grandmother who uh, they call Lois, Losing Streak Lois, I think, because she's got a gambling problem. Losing Streak Lois was uh, caught near the Mexican border and uh, this is one month after she allegedly murdered her husband, gunned down her husband in Minnesota, and then went on the run. And she ended up in Fort Myers, Florida, Florida, uh, Fort, Fort Myers, Florida. So, uh, and supposedly, allegedly, kind of stalked out a woman that looked like her to uh, just take her identity and killed her, allegedly, and stole her credit cards and her car, and then went on the run some more. There was video footage of her in Iowa. I think she was gambling in Iowa too. Um, in, in transit from Minnesota to Fort Myers. And then uh, there's some more footage of her in Fort Myers in a hotel. And I'll play both of those in a second. But she had been on the run for quite some time. And uh, she's, you know, supposedly has killed two people. And she's this sort of innocent looking grandmother, you know. Uh, that's her pictured right there. And uh, two different pictures of her, and here's that's her husband, David Rice. Her name's Lois Rice, um, and here's this is Pamela Hutchinson. That's the woman she allegedly sought out in Fort Myers, Florida, who she believed looked like her, and she could take over her identity and so forth. So she's been captured at the border by U.S. Marshals um, in Texas. So uh, it apparently is over. Over. The uh, gambling addicted granny named, nicknamed Losing Streak Lois. Let me play those videos for you. Uh, here's the one in Iowa, which is kind of the better one because it, ay, 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 um, it shows her like being real polite and nice. And this is after she allegedly killed her husband. She hasn't killed, allegedly, uh, L um, Pamela Hutchinson yet. Um, she hasn't even gotten to Fort Myers yet, but still, here, let me play that. And uh, then uh, some video of her in the uh, it's like a Hilton or something. Uh, I guess this it. Yeah. This is in Fort Myers, Florida. That's the woman's hat. That's Pamela Hutchinson's hat right there. That she supposedly you know stole her identity after she killed her, allegedly. That's the woman's hat, which is pretty uh, creepy to say the least. She seems to have a limp by now. And that's the woman's car. That's her Honda, her Acura. Acura is Honda, right, I think. So, okay, so, you know, she's been caught in, uh, finally, in Texas by U.S. Marshals, and she had a limp in that video, it seemed like, so I don't know if that was from maybe a struggle with Pamela Hutchinson in the murder, you know, and these are all just, you know, allegations at this point, but, so, um, it says, uh, you know, a Minnesota grandmother. This all started in Minnesota, where she gunned down her husband before she moved, you know, took off and headed to Fort Myers, Florida. On the way there, she had stopped in Iowa for some reason to gamble and just on her way there. 
I don't know why she chose Fort Myers, Florida, but uh, she did. So a, a Minnesota grandmother who was wanted over the shooting death of her husband and a woman has been arrested in Texas near the near the U.S. Mexican border. Lois Rice. 56 has been on the run ever since her husband David Rice was found shot dead in their home in Blooming Prairie, Minnesota on March 20, 23rd. Her second alleged victim, uh, Pamela Hutchinson, was found dead at her condo in Fort Myers uh, Beach in Florida on uh, April 9th. And there's uh, they have uh, st images of uh, you know from surveillance of her at the condo. Uh, right immediately following Pamela Hutchinson being murdered. So U.S. Marshal Service statement said two federal deputy marshals arrested Rice Thursday night around 8.30 p.m. at a South Padre Island, Texas restaurant. Hmm. Um, says uh, the Dodge County Sheriff's Office confirms Lois Rice is in police custody. We will have more details for the public and media tomorrow. This is at 7.42 p.m. Uh, South Padre Island is a beach resort um, community 27 miles from the crossing into Mexico. Reese was sitting at the restaurant by herself when the deputies arrested her. Authorities believe Rice, who allegedly used the same gun in both shootings, uh, may have targeted Hutchinson to assume her identity because they look similar. Surveillance videos released just hours before Rice was caught showed her walking away from the Marine Village in Fort Myers uh, Beach soon after she allegedly killed the Hutchin uh, killed Pamela Hutchinson. That's the video I just showed you of the uh, the uh, hotel where she's got the hat on. So another video captured Rice driving away from the hotel in Hutchinson's 200 2005 white Acura. Rice was also spot on. Uh, closed circuit TV cameras driving to up to a Hilton hotel in Akala before calmly walking through the lobby wearing her alleged victim's hat. So there's two different videos there, and they just put them into one. You know, the Hilton hotel and the uh, the Marina Village in Fort Myers Beach uh, soon after she allegedly killed uh, Hutchinson. So. Anyways, uh, she's been caught, man. Lee County Sheriff's Office would not reveal when the surveillance videos were captured. Authorities believe Rice then headed west through Louisiana in Hutchinson's car, the car she, she is thought to have been driving when, uh, when she uh, was last spotted in Corpus Christi, Texas. And uh, that's it, man. Thanks for watching my videos. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me a like down below. I'll see you in the next video. Later, man.